in your 21 years as a forensic accountant, how would you say the role has changed for yourself and others? Uh, the most significant impact has been uh, technology uh, and how technology has uh, assisted us and, and the, the sort of disputes and investigation industry generally. Um, and over that period of time, I mean, I certainly remember um, as a trainee spending weeks and weeks in a, in a, in a law firm office trawling through multiple boxes of hard copy uh, accounting data. And those days, although there are cases that are still around that are quite um, document intensive in terms of hard copy documents, the vast majority of the time the, the documents tend to be electronic. Um, and that has had quite a, an impact in terms of how we undertake our work uh, and also an impact on clients and, and also time scales. So just to give you an example, um, often we'll receive documents electronically as a forensic accountant, so that makes it a lot easier to search through those documents, to be able to interrogate those documents. It does mean that uh, it's a lot easier to find what, what it is that we're actually looking for. So you could use a document review platform, for example, which you can run keyword searches, you can reduce the, the document population by, by um, date ranges, uh, which obviously means that it speeds up an investigation, it makes it more cost effective, it means that you can find the relevant documents quicker. So the expectations on us as a forensic accountant is that you, you hopefully find the, 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 what you're looking for in, in, in much quicker than, than maybe sort of 15, uh, 20 years ago. Uh, so I think that's probably had the, the, the most significant impact in terms of what it is that we, that we do. I think also it's had an impact in terms of how people work so you don't necessarily need to be uh, on site at a client. You don't necessarily need to be in your office to enable you to do work. So, you know, if you, as long as you've got an internet connection, you can kind of log into a document review platform. You can receive documents over email, etc., to enable you to work pretty much when it, it, anywhere in the world. As long as you have an internet connection, and, and that connectivity is, has changed things quite significantly in the way that we work. And a lot of sectors are seeing. AI being used a lot more, which is perhaps changing the way that accountants work, but is, in this case, is the human element still really, really important when analysing that data? The human element is essential, but we overlay that with, with AI-type capability. So, for example, the document review platform Relativity that we have has an AI component. However, it's, it's, it's machine learning, so it, it learns from us as sort of subject experts, as accountants, and it will basically synthesize the information based on certain inputs. So it's, it, the human element is not, certainly not gone, it's essential, but it's using that technology to assist us in terms of getting to where we get to as quickly and cost-effectively as possible. So what sort of practical things can that technology help with then, the AI technology? So in terms of technology assisting a, a large investigation, for example, you may start off with, say, two million documents, you're clearly it's not proportionate and often uh, if you need to find something quite quickly to analyse all of those documents you'd be you'd, you'd, it would take potentially months to go through those documents so it's using uh, keyword searches, it's using date ranges to um, quickly get to the, to the relevant batch of documents to help you to understand what's happened in a fraud, to understand the key documents, the key people that are involved and that can, that can basically speed up the, the investigation. If you're using uh, the AI type technology, it will learn from the way that you are tagging relevant documentation, for example. It will learn the type of documentation that you're, you're tagging. It will, then ha it will then, over time, synthesize those documents to, to, to make sure that the population of documents that you're looking at is the most, is the most relevant and obviously cut down on the amount of time that it takes to, to review those documents. And has this technology been gradually introduced, or is there sort of a moment you can remember which suddenly just this all changed and the role changed? There isn't a moment in time that I can remember when suddenly this this, this changed. However, it's been a, it's been a gradual uh, process um, over the last decade or so, and obviously the technology has become more and more um, sophisticated. The AI, the underlying AI technology is recognised by by courts as a, as a very valid and proportionate way to undertake document review. Um, so it's been a gradual process uh, and the technology is obviously being enhanced all, all the time. And has the technology changed the skills required to be a forensic accountant at all when you're looking for people to hire? Has that changed over the last 20 years? Or I think technology is an important uh, part of our, our role and certainly when we are um, recruiting, it's important to understand if people have experience of using uh, that technology. 
they don't necessarily have to understand the the sort of underlying technology, but as a as a user and as sort of having that sort of user interface, we do look for people that have experience of of, of utilising that that technology. And certainly in my team, we've got a real fantastic expertise of liaising with our forensic technology team, and explaining exactly how how we want things to be done. And and they will obviously advise from their sort of technology perspective the optimal way of uh, of, of doing that. Okay.